family, how's everyone? I'm so happy that this new project is starting in a big style, in a big form, in a big way. And I'm so delighted that uh, the crew, my crew, are doing a fantastic job. Very, very well. Before you know it, things are already rolling in. That is what is going on. Right here, uh, we are doing this job, this project. This project is going to be another raft foundation. And that is what we have started working on. We have done the blinding. We did the setting now, done the blinding. And before the blinding, we have our first take of waterproof. Now it's about to start the boxing. I mean, the shutting of the high on works, the raft itself, the raft beam. Let me show you what we got. This is what we got at this project that is going on. You can see all the iron works in place. Everything in line. Let me show you. You can see what we have going on. All our iron in place. And then all these ones, these irons are there. These are 10 millimeter by eight millimeter. We're using the eight millimeter as our stirrups. And we have those ones there. And you can see the angle whereby this locks in. This is 135 degree that the iron bender makes sure he does it because this is the best way to lock in the iron rod. So, but you can see the way it is, and uh, this one is one, one meter high. These are one meter high uh, for this, uh, for this. That is what we have in here. You can see them and the pillars. You see the pillars are in there uh, to make sure everything goes the way it is. See, we are even set up uh, so you can see this one is going to be the, uh, the main area, the living area for the pool. That's what we have. And we have the kitchen area in this section. That is what is going on in this, in this project. It's looking so beautiful. It's looking interesting. And I'm so happy for the detail work that are being done for the engineering work that have been done. I am so glad and I'm so delighted for what I'm seeing because people are doing something right and doing it the best way. Because this is the only way you make sure you fight against the water problem that we have in Gambia during the rainy season. During the rainy season, you discover that everywhere is going to be jam-packed with water. Water everywhere and then it's, it's, it's not easy for your foundation. So let us go so I can show you the rest of this project. Oh, you can see this land, you can see that it's not, it's not really a big land, uh, but it's moderate enough to get the things done. That is what we have here. So uh, we have a land here, and this is the setback to the this is setback to the to the to the road. This is the front of the property, and this is where we have the property itself. Uh, but the land goes all the way. It goes all the way, coming all the way here. You can see the end of the block. This is the end of the block. This is the end of the block here, and that is the block here. So we have all this area will be for the service. All the area will be for other things. We locate our uh, located our uh, water borehole on that side, and our septic is going to be on this side. So that is what we have here. You can see this is a job that is going places and i love what you have done so far and i love how things are turning out so good it is interesting and it is beautiful and it is exciting what i'm seeing things are done right and done the best way it's supposed to be and that is what i'm talking about see uh let me show you something that we did you can see uh come this way let me show you and you'll see what I want to show you about. Yeah. Alright. So uh, this area is going to be for our staircase and this area is going to be a sit out for the for the kitchen. It's a sit out for the kitchen we have here. And this place you can see the blinding. The blinding that was done. And you can see those white lines. Those white lines are the lines of the thickness that we follow. So that means we have to do the setting out separately uh, for the high on rods, for the beams that's coming in. So that is what we did, mark out. We mark out the lines. Those lines are for the beams. Those lines are the one that shows you where the beam is. So after we dug, uh, our dig we had our digging after the digging we did the blinding 
uh, before the blinding, we put our waterproof, and after the, uh, the blinding, then we brought in the carpenter to come and mark out everywhere that's going to be where the iron will be placed. Very, very important. That is how we do the job. That is how we nail the job. That is how we get this done. It is getting interesting. It is fantastic. I'm loving what I'm seeing. This project is going places. Another raft foundation. One of the reasons we did the raft foundation is here. You can see what we have. You can see here is because the, the land slopes this way. It slopes to the back. And not only that, you can see that we have this section. This section is like a valley. So like a valley in that place, that area that you have like a valley in that place, that place, that area, the, when, the, when it's rainy season, water back out. When it's in the rainy season, there's a lot of water that come back to this area where we are now. So it's very important to make sure we get it right. And we do it right at one time. That is why we have to go nine yards for this to make sure it is done right and it is secure. Because with this one, you know, you have a rest of mind. You are well assured that you are standing on nothing else but a solid foundation. Blessings and blessings, brothers and sisters. Continue to share this video. Continue to tell somebody about Team Concept Builders. Please continue to subscribe. It will make me so happy if you can subscribe more. I will so much appreciate that if you can do that for me. Blessings and blessings. Peace.